Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to How To Be Happy January. Because my dogs bring me so much joy, it's so cool to be able to turn around and like return the favor to them. I basically stole this idea slash recipe from my friend here on YouTube, Lee, or Little House in the Mountain. When I saw her feeding her dogs this way, I had to jump on this bandwagon. So many of you guys expressed your excitement to see this video, so today I am going to show share our puppy scoots recipe. The ingredients that we used on this day to make our dog's food were cut green beans in a can, chicken breast, sweet peas, jasmine rice, and eggs. By the way, we got all of these ingredients at Costco. So it's funny because when I found this recipe, I was the one that was like committed and excited to start making this food. But once Dan saw my excitement and what I was looking into, he actually ended up taking this over. So he's the one that now makes all of the doggy food and we do call it scoots if you heard that in the beginning. So he starts off by just opening all the cans, pouring it in one of these little strainers. And then once he has Add some water boiling piping hot he scooped the eggs in he does it this way by the way because it's so hot it's not super comfortable to just drop in by hand um, but if you drop it from too high of a point they actually crack and then cook weird I don't know so this is the way he does it you can actually see one of the eggs that cracked and like the egg starts spilling out of it um, so yeah this is the way that he's found prevents that a little more so he dumped out all the veggies and then last but not least he dumped the chicken breast into the mix as well and then he poured all of that into a little bowl and kind of like chopped everything up a little bit and mixed it together so that every little bite would be even at this point he pulled that jasmine rice out of the microwave it's super easy to make by the way we realized that doing bulk rice would be much more cost effective and we're working on our bulk food storage in general but um this is what he used and we love this stuff so yeah he cooked it up stirred it into the mix as well all the while zoe was so excited they know every time we're making their scoots <laughs> and now when we say like do you want some scoots they know exactly what it is anyways he took the eggs out of the water cooled them off with some cool water and then dumped the eggs into an ice bath for a couple of minutes after they sat and they had a chance to kind of cool down, Dan does this little trick to help loosen the eggshells where he kind of shakes the eggs together like you can see and look at how the skins fall off. He has like really perfected this and he swears it's the tip of letting the water boil before you put the eggs in and then also salt bay <laughs> and then putting them in the ice bath and then shaking out the eggs like you saw to help the initial loosening of the shells. Literally, they they can't wait while we do this. It's so cute. So then Dan took the wood spoon, mashed the eggs up into the mix as well. And then last but not least, he took a good helping of organic olive oil. And what's my favorite phrase? Added that to the mix too. And oh my gosh, Zoe is like a really picky eater, whereas Bowser will eat like anything from the table and be excited about all food. That is not Zoe, but this food, Zoe absolutely loves. Um, this has honestly, I think, made their life more enjoyable and it's really cool to see how excited they get about eating real whole food. By the way, guys, just so you know, um, we're actually making a video all about our pups. I get so many questions about their breed and their personality and just what it's like to have them in our lives. So I just wanted to give you a heads up that we are making that video and yeah. Thank you so much guys for coming back to my channel and checking out my videos. Be sure to check out my How To Be Happy January playlist on my channel if you haven't already. I am uploading Monday, Wednesday, and Friday the entire month. And I will see you guys back here soon on Monday. All right, bye guys.